Camilo, thank you so much for sitting down with us today at the Kenyan Wall Street. Thank you for inviting me, Andrew. So you work with a company called Minka, based out of Latin and South America. Can you tell us a little bit more about it? Yeah, Minka, it's a fintech company. We are based in Colombia and we enable interoperable real-time payment networks. So we are the ones that technologically enabled the only real-time payment rail that is work currently working in Colombia. And we are working very hard for us to expand this into other Latin American countries and now hopefully some African countries. Yes, that's great. And we're here at the 10th Africa FinTech Summit in Lusaka, Zambia. Is this your first time in Zambia? It's my first time in Zambia and also my first time in Africa. Ah, well, Karibu. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, what, what have been some things you have learned this week at the FinTech Summit about Africa's financial technology ecosystem? It has actually surprised me. I, I mean, I, I know that really cool stuff is going on in Africa right now and in fintech ecosystem, but I'm really surprised and also with high expectations of the things that are going to be built here in Africa. Yeah, that's, that's, that's exactly true. And, you know, one of the things I believe is Africa has very unique use cases yeah. for this technology that don't exist, you know, in the North America and the Europe's of the world and such. Um, what has been one thing that you learned this week? One thing that I learned this week, uh, the impact of mobile money operators. I think that that's one of the unique use cases that you have, you have here in Africa. You don't see this even in Latin. You have some mobile money operators, but are pretty small and are in a closed ecosystem in here you have been able to make them interoperable, not fully, because there's also some things that, opportunities that, for example, Minka could start mm -hmm. enabling here, but they are kind of interoperable and making them like the base of financial inclusion is, is amazing. Okay, that's great. And what are Minka's plans for Africa? You, you had mentioned that you're considering expansion or have already started this. Uh, what are your plans? Yeah, we have already started uh, like some business development conversations for us to first map the whole continent and understand what are potential opportunities here. Um, one of the biggest ones that we have mapped is to enable this cross-border interoperability between payment systems. Like you guys have uh, different economic groups like Western African economies, Eastern African economies, yeah. and make them interoperable first within each other and then throughout the whole continent is a huge opportunity that we want to, to pursue. And as the interoperable, you know, payments and transfers kind of mechanism, who are your customers? Who do you typically work directly with? We have like different tiers of customers. The tier one are central banks and clearing houses because we need to build, actually build the payment rail. Mm -hmm. And then the tier two customers will be banks because okay. then banks need to connect and financial institutions, not only banks, banks, mobile money operators, fintechs, and then some kind of, in Colombia, we have them like cooperatives, but like microfinance institutions yes. that we need, we want them to connect to this ecosystem to make it fully interoperable. So those are kind of our customers, not the end users. Okay, that's great to hear. And now just to finish us off today, I got a few quick fire questions if you don't mind. Go ahead. Uh, what's your favorite food? Favorite food, it's going to be sushi. Sushi? Yeah. Oh, nice. I love sushi. <laughs> and uh, when you need to release and feel happy, what music do you listen to? What genre? Vallenato. It's like a local music in Colombia. Mm -hmm. uh, you have like an accordion, kind of the German accordion, but we tropicalize it and bring it to Latam, and it's Vallenato. You should hear it. I'm going to show you... Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A song of Vajinato for you. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us at the Kenyan Wall Street today. And I'm happy that you have enjoyed uh, and learned a lot from your first time here on the continent and in Zambia. Thank you. Thank you a lot for the invitation, Andrew. And hopefully it's my first time of many coming here to Africa. Of many. When you come to Nairobi, let us know. <laughs> let us know. Sure, sure, sure. All right. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you, man.